Today we're installing a red dot enclosure specifically designed for the triple track top. The top itself is universal and the enclosures are cart specific. Refer to your instructions for the proper bracket placement to make sure that your enclosure fits nicely. Before we begin our installation, I want to explain how the triple track works. The inside channel here is where your accessories and your mounting brackets will attach to the top. The center track is where your enclosure will slide in to the track itself. The outer track here is for your enclosure valance. Our first step is we're going to install our front strut covers. You'll notice the stops for the zippers go at the top. If you look on the back side, you'll see a center zipper here. So now you'll locate your windshield clip hole. You're going to attach this with the clip on the outside and point it towards the rear. Now we're going to secure the cover to the strut by attaching the zipper on the back side. We're going to repeat this on the other side. Let's go over the proper orientation of the driver's side panel before we install it in the track. A couple things to note. You'll see the roll-up snaps go on the inside. You'll also see the tag, which is on the inside. You'll also notice the hooks. These go on the inside of the enclosure on the bottom. The last thing, you'll see it lines up with a rear tire well. Now you're going to insert the driver's side panel into the center channel of your triple track. Right. Once you get it started, make sure to support the back end and keep it up as high as possible so that it's not binding as you slide through the channel. Now that our front panel is installed, we're going to secure it with the zipper at the front strut cover. We're going to repeat this on the other side. With our two side panels in place, we're going to move to the rear of the cart. You want to make sure that the snaps are on the inside of the vinyl and that we insert this into the same center track that we did the two side panels. Now you're going to take the back panel and flip it over the back of the grab bar and finally secure the two corners with the zippers. With all three sides in place, we're now going to install our balance. We're going to start on the rear. You'll notice on the rear portion, the two outside edges have the rough hook fasteners. You'll also see that the snap buttons have a black finish cap on them. We're going to put this on the outer channel of the triple track. Moving to the driver's side valance, on the back edge of the valance, you'll have the softer loop side, and on the front side, you'll have the rougher hook side here. Again, the black finish caps will be on the bottom. Same thing here, we're going to go in the outer track. Now we're going to do the same thing on the passenger side. We're going to put our windshield on. You'll see we've made a mark here at the lower end of the OEM strut. This is where the pre-drilled hole is. So we're going to take the bolt that's included with our windshield and insert it into those holes. We recommend using a razor knife and making a small X at that location. We're going to repeat this process on the other side. Now we're going to attach our windshield to our struts. Now when you flip your windshield up, the cutouts allow you to lock it into place. The last piece we're going to install is the front balance. It's going to go in the front track, outside track, same as the others. 
You also notice on the inside of this piece, there's two smooth loop sides of the strip, as well as no finished button caps on the outside here, as there's no enclosure to roll up. With all of our balance in place, we're gonna now marry up the hook and loop fasteners to each other on each end of the balance. If you have any excess tubing, continue to run that into the next channel. Now we're gonna repeat this around the rest of the cart. And we're gonna make sure that all four corners are nice and evenly spaced. When the enclosure is down, be sure to secure it at the bottom with the pre-installed hooks. When not in use, unzip the four corners, roll up your enclosure, and secure it behind the valance. You now finished installing your red dot enclosure designed for the triple track top.